limitless beings receiving from a limitless source in unlimited ways and welcome back to my channel my name is cassidy and i mentor busy professionals to detox their mind and body gain more energy and live a natural lifestyle so they can snatch back their power and welcome to this edition of free yourself friday every single friday i post a new video for you so that you can dismantle all the fuckery that's been done to us and is being done to us let's be real i'm not gonna sugarcoat it that's just what it is right so super grateful that you are here right now it's not a coincidence that you clicked on my video so i love it you're right where you need to be so on today's edition of free yourself friday i'm going to be talking with you about three things that i ditched and switched that actually not only saved my health but also saved me some money thank you thank you thank you to my past self for doing this because now i'm like well why did I wait so long to do that? So super grateful. So after today's video, you're gonna walk away knowing three things that you can ditch or maybe just minimize your usage of them to save yourself some money and to really be mindful of the effects that they are having on your precious sacred health. That literally is the most important thing because if we don't have our health, then what do we have, right? We have all the riches in the world, but we can't enjoy it because we're on our deathbed and what does it even matter, right? So let's go ahead and dive into the first thing that I ditched and switched to save my health and save my money. And this thing is plastic water bottles. So microplastics have been found in water bottles. Microplastics have been found amongst other chemicals and things in the placentas of unborn babies. It's crazy. It's really crazy how they get us like even when we're in the womb, right? So shout out to you mamas that are doing your best to make sure that you have the most healthy environment for your baby and those of us who are not yet mothers, at least physically, cause hey, I'm helping birth a new earth baby. So I am, I consider myself a mama, but hey, I'm not a mom yet physically, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna try to go like, you know, go to the mom's eat free club and be like, I have a dog. So this counts <laughs> quick story at a restaurant that I worked at. Someone did that once. So just had to throw that out there. <laughs> Hopefully it makes you laugh. And um, yeah, so, you know, it's beautiful because everything that we're doing today, women, um, you know, is setting up, setting ourselves up to be one for one, be fertile and be able to actually have a baby. And also just to literally, um, the the toxicity that we experience right now um that we that we have been exposed to like begins as early as in utero it's wild so anyways shout out to all of you natural minded parents that are doing the damn thing and so back to the water bottles so um you know there have been like over 25 24,500 different chemicals found in bottled waters the regulations are so loose for um you know testing the levels of contamination so most bottled waters have very very unsafe levels of um of toxins they shouldn't even have them in there but they're not even they're not even safe so if we can let's just avoid drinking bottled water as much as possible and this should add up right this is expensive um what we can do for a solution to this is to get your own water bottle and of course definitely look into um, how that bottle was made if it, it does plastic i don't recommend plastic get yourself a stainless steel or glass water bottle and just make sure that you're really reading into um, if this water bottle is leaching chemicals it's really important right it's something you're going to be using every single day it's an investment invest in a good quality water bottle right um, so obviously I would recommend getting an amazing water purification system, a water filter. I use Berkey right now, which I'm super grateful for. I added on the fluoride filters. Of course, that's like number one, most important thing that we need to detox out of our water. So I did that with my big Berkey filter. There's different sizes. I have the big Berkey. Um, and then I add in trace mineral drops, trace minerals brand, trace mineral drops into my water a water system that i am manifesting that i am just like ready to get today and still doing a little bit more research on the investment that i make in my mac daddy top of the line water system but the one that i'm really looking at is pristine hydro so i'll keep you guys posted of course on what i end up deciding with and this is just so important to me because water it's the foundation of 
our health. Like it's everything, right? So just one of those things too, where it's like, I could slam it on it today, but even if it's like, you just put it on a credit card. I mean, that's totally up to you, but it's just such a crucial part of our health that it's a non-negotiable. It's an investment. It's something that is so worth the investment. So what else about the water? I think that pretty much covers it. I also want to remind you too that, you know, you are also saving the earth. You are also, you know, Mother Earth smiles every single time you don't use a plastic water bottle, right? So it is good for ego and it is good for eco, right? Not for ego, but you know what I mean. It's beautiful to realize that it goes deeper than just us. This affects every single thing in the universe, including our beautiful sacred Earth. So let's do better now that we know better and let's get ourselves a water bottle and stop buying these damn toxic, expensive, stupid water bottles <laughs> second thing that i ditched and switched to save my health and my money is makeup don't get triggered ladies hear me out and yes i ditched it and i switched it to cleaner brands of makeup but also i pretty much just kind of ditched it i rarely wear it i pretty much wear it sometimes when i make videos when i make my youtube videos right um and i just want to talk about like the intention of everything so makeup is fun makeup is is awesome, right? Makeup is a form of a creative expression. One of my sisters, she loves to put on makeup because it, it relieves her anxiety, right? It's fun. And um, yeah, it just enhances our natural beauty. And it's all about, like I said, intention, seeing how it feels for you and really just kind of tuning into, am I doing this from like a lack of confidence or to, because I don't embrace my natural beauty or am I doing this because I love myself and it's fun and I know I'm beautiful naturally but it's just something that I just enjoy doing and that I just enjoy um, being a woman and this aspect of you know my womanhood right so this is up to you to decide right and for you to tune into um, I noticed that when I was younger I had a job where I wore makeup every single day and so from seeing my face fully made up so much it made me feel like I needed it more like I liked my face better with makeup on now I actually like my face better with makeup off so um I but also it's fun like I mean I was feeling myself I was like getting my I was doing my makeup and I was like listening to my goddess affirmations and like you know so there's a beauty I enjoy my face too but now I'm just like wow I really embrace the natural beauty so um you know what happens typically too is when we you know, um, increase our confidence when we heal our gut microbiome, which is connected to our mental health as well. Um, and when we, you know, increase, expand our consciousness, typically we're going to kind of want to use makeup less is usually what I've experienced and what others have experienced. So once again, everything goes back to intention. I'm actually going to link below and towards the beginning of my spiritual awakening journey, um, on my old Instagram, I, posted a video about this and about um for us women to just really tune into um makeup and what it can do to us and just um just being mindful like i said going back to the intention and of course just remembering that you know our skin is our biggest organ so definitely ditching and switching and yeah i'll go ahead and link some brands that i really like below for natural beauty brands that you can ditch and switch to the third thing that I ditched and switched to save my health and my money along my detox spiritual awakening journey is restaurant food. I didn't completely ditch it, of course, but I really did ditch that greasy, sometimes fried restaurant food and tipping and tipping too, right? That's also an added in factor and expense to restaurant, to going to a restaurant which can be worth it, right? If that is something that you value investing in, of course, but doing that pretty often, you see how that adds up and oh my goodness, I know if some of y'all added up like I did back in my younger years, like I added up my expenses and my food and I'm like, this is ridiculous. Like literally me and my ex-partner, like we kept a list of like our, um, you know, food, like how much that we spent on food that one month and we were like, yo, all right, we're going to start meal prepping way more now because this is ridiculous. <laughs> like, this is not okay. So I know that you might feel that too, that like majority of my money was going to food and it's ridiculous. So 
I cook at home majority of the time, obviously not just for, you know, saving money, but just for my health reasons when I started awakening to like, oh my gosh, every restaurant uses canola oil pretty much. And yeah, it's just such a non-negotiable for me. And that's something that I help my clients with inside of DDM to really get clear on their values and find solutions for themselves and what works for them. Like for example, a couple of my clients really utilize the meal prepping company. So perhaps you just don't have time or don't have I don't know you might though or even the energy too you know like to um take I love taking an hour on Sundays and just prep out some food and at least now for like Monday and Tuesday I know that I'm set I start the week off really strong with my consistent healthy eating so these meal prep companies are awesome so you can just search for a local meal prep company near you and this is another really great way to just set yourself up for success with your healthy eating goals and um, yeah another thing that you can do too such a simple thing right we can get an instant pot and we can um, create a one pot meal in the morning and have it simmering all day and then come home to that and there you go you got you got uh, your dinner right you could do that five times a week absolutely monday through friday and that would just save you so much money alone it's amazing so yes i am so grateful that you tuned in to today's free yourself friday and if you really enjoy these detox tips and you're ready to dive deeper into your detox journey your holistic health journey and really take back control of your health really find solutions to some of these health obstacles that you're having i created something just for you it is literally a one-stop shop for your mind body and spirit it is my two-month holistic health mentorship program and what happens when we take control of our life hey we know in this society right in this um, system that we live in we do save our lives so if this is something that is calling you and you're just ready to make that first step then you can dm me your email or you can head to my instagram and click the link in my bio to drop your email there and sign up for the wait list and then from there i'll email you some more information about the divine detox method which is beginning in the beginning of 2022 so thank you so much again for tuning into this video and if you enjoyed it please smash that like button subscribe to my channel and of course as always share this with someone that might really really get their eyes open, get their world rocked, and just kind of be like, hey, you want to be my accountability buddy? Okay, yeah. All right, let's do it. Okay, let's start making some one-pot meals and stop spending our money on dis-ease causing food. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Thank you so much again, beloveds, and sending you my love, sending you my light. Namaste.